We are creating our own album covers. Pack Street Boys. Talk to us. Thanks! <laughs> it's like touching a hedgehog with laxative. P-A-Q We present It's a cover up It's a cover up Welcome back. If you don't know who we are, we are PAQ and we are a fashion show based on YouTube, as you know, because you're watching us on YouTube right now. But we have a family of over 220,000 people. It's so crazy. We never thought we'd be here. If you want to join the family, make sure you hit subscribe, hit the notifications. Episodes every Thursday, man. The feedback you guys have been giving is absolutely overwhelming. We love reading the comments. We love hearing all about what you want to see, what you've enjoyed seeing, etc., etc. So to give a little something back, the first five people to comment on this video will receive a carry tote bag and a few little goodies. Help in our community. Community service. So this week we are teaming up with a very special brand, very close to my heart. We are teaming up with Spotify. Woo! -hoo! Tunes for the man them. Spotify. Spotify have set us the maddest challenge. We have never done anything like this before. We are creating our own album covers in teams of two. Damn. So that means we literally have to come up with the concept of a band, come up with the concept of the backdrop, come up with the concept of costume. So if for some reason you guys don't know what Spotify is, there's a link in the description. It is a new tier. It is completely free for life. There is no credit cards or anything to sign up, all that good stuff. If you follow me on Instagram personally, you'll see that I enjoy sharing my, uh, my actual playlist. I share it quite a lot. Your playlist is dry though. If the right people saw it, I would be DJing so many old men's 50th birthday parties. Wow. I'd be the best dad's family party gathering DJ of all time. You can see how much music has an influence on fashion and how much fashion has yeah, influence on music. Exactly. You've got people like ASAP Rocky, who, you know, literally talks about people like Raph Simmons, talks about Dior all the time. Besides the music I listen to, the music I make is an expression, and I believe, you know, in self-expression, that's mostly why I wear black. Um, due to how I express myself musically and the musicians I listen to. You just got Push T's new album, which is Whitney Houston's Bathroom. Yeah. And that is the album cover. Like, Kanye paid, I think it was 80 grand. He paid a lot of money to get the rights to this photo to use as Push T's album artwork. Well, let's talk about iconic album covers. You've got Nas with it on my... The Beatles, Abbey Road. Yep, Dead Presidents. Yeah, Michael Jackson Thriller's album cover. Wow, I love that. Who's Michael Jackson? Both teams have to work with Meeks. We've got one week to do from start to finish, whether that's getting outfits, getting studios, getting this, that, and the other. And we need an album title. Me and Shaq versus Danny and Dex. One week to make our album cover. Let's get it. <laughs> oh, that's a train fart. Mad thing. Me and Elle took a train all the way down to Bedford because we are here at Twinwood Adventure. This is where we're going to be indoor skydiving. When the challenge was first announced, very hyped. Partnered with Shaq, very hyped. Album cover, very hyped. So we went straight onto Spotify, started looking at album covers. And there's so many like iconic album covers as well. There's like Lauren Hill, Erica Badu, you know, Missy Elliott stuff was so iconic, man. At first we were like, okay, we know what we're gonna do. We're gonna do that whole kind of like P. Diddy floating style, the boiler seat vibe. And that song, More Money, More Problems, where they were just like floating with like the skydiving thing. So me and Ellis were like, yeah, that's such a vibe. We need to understand what it means to be aerodynamic. Is that? Yeah, it works. Yeah, aerodynamic. Dexter and I have been brainstorming ideas about what we should do this album cover. And we noticed that we get called a boy band a lot. A boy band is what the people want. A boy band is what the people shall receive. Full Backstreet Boys. Pack Street Boys. I don't know what Migos is very afraid they're called a boy band. We the Migos! We know the boy band though. Call up my mama on my check phone.
So we're just downloading the Spotify app now. What you start off with is you hit a screen like this, and then what you do is you choose like five or more artists that you like. It will tailor your home screen to you. It's like, oh, well, if you like that, then you might like this. It's all recommended. It's very like personal. Here we go. The Wanted. Okay, all right. So JLS. Elias Riadi all over. Busted. McFly. Oh. Then there's McBusted. <laughs> <laughs> so we're gonna have a quick listen for inspiration while we look at some uh, old album covers. As soon as I stepped in there, I thought, right, I'm gonna literally float straight out of the atmosphere, fam. Yo, learning to fly, yeah. I felt like we was in Harry Potter and we Bro. was doing the broomstick thing. We were trying to learn how to fly. Quidditch, it, fam. That's yeah, what we was doing. That was mad. So I think it needs to be me and you. All white, yeah. All white? So like, what is the obsession with all black? So what's going to be colour? Well, black. Black's not colour. I know that it's monochrome, but if we're going to talk in a sense, like, of what I wear... So if you're the master of black, then what is black? It's not white, isn't it? <laughs> he looks high. <laughs> the wind, like, do you know when it just rushes through your nose and your mouth? And also, the, the spot of the century, mid-air fam. Yeah, how many men do that? Not many. I feel like, I feel like we need to go, you know, you're like Gareth Gates kind of like, Sure, like, spike hair, three tubs of hair gel on it as well. Damn, that's grease. Like, yeah. you touch it and it's just like, it's like touching a hedgehog with laxative. Oh my days! I know what we should get. Go on. Laxative. We need a bird, like a white yeah. bird. Definitely does. Hello, uh, I have a quick question for you. Um, do you guys sell doves? by any chance. Oh, we don't. No, you don't. OK, that's fine. Welcome to Texas. OK, that is closed. Probably better off trying to get hold of a breeder. A breeder? I'm really excited to work with Danny. Um, I feel like the concept's sick. He's even taken me out of my comfort zone, because I'm going to be wearing all white, baby. But I don't mind, because I'm going to look like an angel. Oh, oh, we're filming. Um, oh, cool. So I want to say a big thank you to Spotify for making this episode possible. Honestly, without them, we'd not be able to do this mad thing. So we've been using their free tier system to find inspiration for the album cover shoots. It's so live. It, it literally knows exactly what I want to listen to. I just like all the tunes, you know, hella 2000 R&Bs. And all it does is recommend me even more 2000 R&B things. Free for life, no credit card. You're gonna be just jamming your tunes all day. It's so sick, especially when you've got friends like mine that all they do is just wanna sleep and snore in your ear when you're trying to chill. So yeah, drowns it out, 30. This guy. What, what drowns out you shouting? What, I, what? Thank you very much, Spotify. Without them, this episode has been possible. It is sick. We've got a link in the description below. Go down on Spotify and you can probably try and get on this guy's wave. So today is the big day. Obviously, me and Shaq are shooting our first album cover. So it's competition at the end of the day, and Dexter just so happened to book the studio and then proceed to tell Shaq the exact name of the studio. So me and Danny, we've briefed Meeks on, you know, what we want and how we want the photo to look. If you see more money, more problems, you've seen P Diddy and them man there floating in the air. That's exactly what me and Shaq are recreating, but on a 70s flex. Do you know what? Good luck to them. I hope that I hope it looks sick. Shaq described you and Danny as what that would be. Because they're a pair of dicks. <laughs> I like it. So my trousers are an amazing Italian brand, Bollioli. I have the Vivian Westwood white loafers. On top of that, a nice white fur jacket. So I've got the white Air Forces, white cheap Monday joggers. 
white kimono and a white do-rag. About to enter heaven. First boy band to have doves in a video. I think so, a lot yeah. of boy band from where to do it. We've, we've, we've established this. So how did you get into this profession? Funerals. Ah. Yeah, funerals? Yeah, people go to funerals quite a lot. Yeah, and same here. Stuff. Usually, that's my, my scene. You catch me in the graveyard near you with ravens. The boys have briefed me on their iconic pitch. What we want to do is like a 70s kind of themed shoot. Yeah, I mean, they got me doing the most, though. There are the, the wires, there's harnesses around as well. We need these, these guns in action, so I hope they're fully loaded. There's, like, there's not that much space, so we can't both be like this angle. So I'm saying the best way to do it is if I'm angled like this and you're angled like this. So who's in the front? It doesn't matter, as long as you're both in the frame, but I'm saying I'm gonna be I'm gonna be leaning this way and you're gonna be leaning this way. Astro's doing the most. He wants this. I knew this was a bad idea. No, trying to put Shaq in the back. All he wants is a spotlight. Bro, that's what I thought we was, we was actually getting along for once. Unless unless you want us to both be like this and with no legs. It's up to I you. I just want us to both be in the photo. Exactly, and that's what's happening. So where do they come from? Where where did they quite like to? Back to Harlow, Oh, right. Wow. So I'm about to go back to West Straighten office. Me and you on the same page, in Doves. <laughs> Myself and Shaquille Keith are both wearing Prada sweaters, flares, Gucci glasses, Gucci belts. Shoo! Hey. Hello. Fuck, I'm giving birth. How's yours chilling so much? <laughs> <laughs> No, thank you very much. I've held plenty of birds. Why wow, we look so flimsy? I thought like Elias. Do you when Ozzy Osbourne bit the head off a bat? I'm pretty sure them lot are doing something pretty mad. Yeah. Wait, why is man swimming? That the height is calm. <laughs> Man's just trying to position. We're holding doves. Well, once, we're in, once we're in position. I had a few too many points tops. last night, didn't so I? If I Make sure you're both in the light, yeah? Yeah, perfect. Ooh, ooh, come on, <laughs> rise, rise, Jack. I can't rise after this. Yeah. The only thing is I'm losing your face a bit. This is actually making me want to fart. We can get some extra wind, do it. Max! W what's going on? Talk to us. Max! Bro, my camera's mash up. Top photographer what, fam? In it, it's your back camera mash up. Just make sure your head's in the light again, bro. This is this. Wait, where do you want me? Because your your shark's getting lost behind you. See, this is I what can't. he was talking about, though. When he was talking about having one photo in a picture, one person in the picture. Make sure you're behind his arms. Homes, please. Oh, shut up, man. You're is, now you're pissing me off. Yeah, but how are oh, you worried about going? Ah! Daniel, come up straight with your posture. Uh, Shaq and his temper. Yeah, but you, man, were just. Oh, uh, let me not even get into that, fam. You're not even playing okay, the game, oh, man. Go. Bro, these guys, yeah, they don't know how to hold it together. They're bickering, fam. <laughs> you're telling me to hurry up and you're there fighting. <laughs> Actually, no, let's get into that. Shaq you was man cussing do... everyone as usual. How long did you're... it take you to start, fam? And then you start fighting. How long did it start? Oh my God. Like I'm like babysitting sometimes, but you know, I'll just let them do their thing. We're not even argue. There Smiled. you go. That's right. Walk away. <laughs> Shaq, I've been hearing he's been throwing, you know, his toys at the pram. Are you Let's stupid? Go. We're not even. <laughs> I hope that all the money spent and all the complaining on their side works out for them. Oh, no, 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 oh, no, 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 no. Down, 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 <laughs> down, 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 down. Calm. I think we've got some good ones. Got it? Okay. Yeah, yeah. Is that the one? Yeah, yeah. All right. Last couple, yeah? Calm. That's the one. I think we got it. Jeez. Just finished up. That was definitely something. Flying is so Bro, tiring. That's why I was sweating. It's so peak. But I can't lie, this guitar is amazing, though. No one's got poo on them. Yes. <sighs> I just remembered I lost my phone. Lol. <laughs> Obviously, we had, we had meeks shooting it. Yeah. Therefore, whatever happens is going to look sick regardless. You just didn't want to. I was in a sick cameraman and, <laughs> and, and a selfless uh, co star in the this band. This guy, you were the diva of that shoot. I want your fucking strawberries. That was crazy fun. That was brilliant. That was sick. Considering yeah. it didn't go to plan as well. Maybe we could just go solo. That was his plan from the beginning. Tomorrow, the judgment day. So Armageddon. If you. So I'm a getting no, out of here. Crap, crap, crap. Crap, crap, crap. Kicks, 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 kicks. Crap, crap, crap.
Hi, I'm Kate Moross. I'm an art director and designer, and I run a design studio in South London called Studio Moross. I'm here to judge the PAQ boys on their album artwork challenge, and I'm looking forward to see what they've got in store for me. So the challenge was we each had to make our own album cover. Me and Alice are partnered up. Dex and Danny were together. So Dex and Danny, do you want to come down and sort of talk me through your idea? Yes. <laughs> well, yes wait, how yeah. can I outsmooth that? Not like that. Danny's that. <laughs> no, that's it, man. So what was the kind of core concept or idea behind your cover? As we are four boys, Everyone always compared to a boy band naturally. Yeah. So we thought, let's go I over see where the this top. Is it's always like the all white angelic kind of stuff like that. But then with our own twist. Before you say any more, I'd like to see what you came up with. Sounds good. Yeah, okay. Oh, oh wow. My. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> Do pimps go to heaven? No. What kind of question is that? Like. Oh, bro, first of all, we don't support that. We're actually revoking Danny's pimp status. Yeah. Realistically, Danny is not a pimp. Dex always calls me a pimp. So it's literally because I don't wear streetwear. So the pimp thing kind of became like a running joke. This joke has gone on for too long. Pimps aren't cool anymore, ladies and gentlemen. I straightened my hair to look yeah, like... Yeah, definitely more thing. queen than I get West. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> It did kind of look like one of them was making like a 80s hair metal record and one of them was making like a hip hop sort of rap record. We hired 20 doves. Oh, wow. No, 22. So we went over to go and see the doves, opened up the basket, lo and behold. Nope, nope. Mm, Mama! So we were supposed to have the doves flying around the photo but instead, the artist ended up flying out before we even got them into the studio. Yeah, I mean, working with animals is always difficult. Yes, working with decks. Do you know what it reminds me of? Uh, GCSE Media and <laughs> album cover. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, yeah. It does, yeah. yeah. <laughs> if, that, if someone submitted that and I was a teacher, I'd give them a U. That's just ungraded. I mean, it's, it's interesting to be part of your, your face to cam next to you as you try and cast every single person. I was literally about to get onto you. <laughs> I knew, I knew it was, I knew. I want to know what your audience is for this record. Who's uh, listening? Probably ages six to eight, you get kids bop, you get pop party, <laughs> and you get the to go to heaven. They, they tried. They, tr they tried, I mean, it must have been so hard to do that album cover. I mean, we could probably recreate it right now. That, I mean, Even though it says parental advisory. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, parental advisory, you can listen to it with your parents. Now then, let go of the doves, love. What I will say about it is, this is damn iconic. You guys, let's hope, let's hope that you've got a better picture. The doves would be better if they were black, you know. I mean, it was great to hear your ideas behind it. Um, Jack and Elias, can you come up and show me what you've come up with? Um, so we ended up going towards like a, a 70s style. Often me and him like wear flares from time to time. So we just went from that and worked our way around it and literally started looking at people like Jimi Hendrix, looking at the whole era of the 70s. You might as well show you, show you what, what we did. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> oh my days, that's... It's so wet. <laughs> They should have been called Love Is All Around because that was wet, wet, wet. <laughs> we named ourselves the Perucci Blues because... The what? Perucci per Blues. We named ourselves the Perucci Blues. The only thing 70s know. was the writing. We're both wearing Prada sweaters, Gucci belts and Gucci glasses. So Prada and Gucci wearing blue, Perucci. Prada and Gucci together makes Perucci, Perucci. Yeah. Oh. Dead, bro. There was this painter called Peter Max, yeah, he's like really renowned. He's like really big in the 70s. He did artwork for the Beatles as well. And this is kind of like his style of artwork. I think like it's a shame that there's not a kind of effect on the graphic. It feels quite flat. I agree. I feel like there does need to be some filter because it looks like you've done it on paint. You've kind of drawn it with like the ruler tool and whatever. The poses could have been a bit better. Like Shaq literally, you, you don't. Did you even have to be on a harness to do that, Shaq? Hold my hood. Hold my hood. This is Shaq. Why do I need to hold your hood? Elise's face, it do, that does look like a kid's bop kind of album. <laughs> the outfits weren't even 70s. No, apart from I wear flares, bruv. 2018, people wear flares, bruv. So I've had some time to think about everything uh, and reflect. So I think Danny and Dex, I, I really liked your enthusiasm and your references. Um, and Shaq and Elias, I think you guys 
really thought about every element, like from the type to the illustration uh, to the styling, but I think you got caught up in the technical with the flying. So the winner of the album artwork challenge is the Perucci Blues. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>